With another 1.2 billion euros leaking out of Greek banks on Friday, bringing the weekly figure to 4.2 billion, according to Reuters, a cash crunch is looming for the Greeks. Some banks and travel agents are advising holidaymakers to take extra cash with them in case ATMs are shut down during their holidays. Yet the markets were unperturbed on Friday. Is it the calm before the storm? We're now joined by Angus Campbell, senior analyst at FX Pro in London. Angus, let me start with the market's reaction to the Greek crisis. There are few signs of panic. Why is that? The markets aren't panicking yet because they feel that there is still very much a deal to be had. And we have this next big, big landmark me meeting on Monday. But really, it's, it's a crucial uh, day Monday because... Time is sort of running out, really, for any agreement to be made because it has to be done ahead of the end of the month for Greece to ratify it in their parliament. So really time is running out. But what it does demonstrate more than anything else is the political will remains. It's very, very clear. Angus, the European Central Bank has accepted Athens' request for more emergency liquidity. This is a bit of um, a, a sort of standout uh, landmark um, event only because it, it comes um, outside of their normal weekly review of, of the Greece funding situation. So it's a sort of one-off to get Greece through the weekend and to Monday because the ECB has always been consistent in saying it will remain there to aid Greece as long as negotiations look like there's going to be some sort of an outcome. So we have this extension to Monday and they are willing to obviously um, just extend that emergency funding today. What's more dangerous for Greece? Its inability to repay creditors or a run on the banks? Well, I think that they come uh, very separately and they'll come in, um, uh, in steps. If we don't get a deal, then you're going to get the first step first, that'll be capital controls, uh, before the default at the end of the month. <laughs> But I think certainly capital controls really is just um, as, in, uh, you know, as significant as a default because we know that without a deal, Greece is not going to be able to really um, meet its obligations at the end of this month and certainly not through the summer. It was Angus Campbell, senior analyst at FX Pro in London. Angus, thank you very much indeed. Pleasure.